adding a vehicle to an IRP account. Welcome to Tennessee Taxpayer Access Point. The data you will see in this course is completely fictitious. Any resemblance to a real person or business is entirely coincidental. Use the playback controls at the bottom of the screen to pause the course, to repeat a part or to move forward more quickly. In this example, we have already logged into 10TAP. To begin, click the View Registration link for the period you want to review. The registration screen shows information related to the IRP account. Here, you can view pending supplements, validations, and supplement alerts. To add a vehicle, click the Add Vehicles hyperlink. You have the options to add one vehicle at a time, or multiple vehicles at once by importing a spreadsheet. Select Add a new vehicle. Here you may enter information about the vehicle to register it. First, complete the Vehicle Identification Information section. Next, enter the vehicle information. You are required to search for the vehicle make by clicking the search button. Enter the name of the vehicle make. Click search. Click the vehicle make hyperlink. Click next to proceed. If the vehicle is under lease, indicate that here. Next, complete the carrier responsible for safety section. Enter the purchase information. Enter the factory price if available. If you are unsure, click the checkbox next to I do not know my vehicle factory price. The factory price will auto-populate. Click next to proceed. Select whether you are applying for a title. If yes is selected, additional information will be required. Click next to proceed. The weight fields will already have the default gross vehicle weight entered. If needed, you may change the gross vehicle weights in this table. Click Next to proceed. Next, you'll choose any credentials needed. Click Next to proceed. Review the submission information. Attach any required documentation by clicking the Add hyperlink. Click OK. Click Submit. Click OK to confirm your submission. Click the period hyperlink to return to the registration period. You are brought back to the registration period. Here, you can see your pending supplement. Click the submit link to submit your supplement. Select whether you are picking up your plate and or decals in office. Click OK. Your changes have been submitted. Click OK to return to the registration period. You can check the status of your supplement by accessing the Supplements tab. This supplement is in the submitted status. This concludes adding a vehicle to an IRP account.